Now the warrior robots in disguise are in their own action-packed Transformer comic on sale now from Marvel Comics. Thanks for watching. Like and comment. And don't forget to subscribe. Hello everybody, this is Toys R Us and for this special video showcase we're going to once again be returning to the Transformers UK comic. What we're going to do for the first couple of minutes or so is just flick from cover to cover, doing a quick review, stopping at anything that's interesting. And to be honest there's a really funny uh, Grimlock film review of the movie in this as well so I'm going to stop on that. Um, we're up to issue number 91, this originally came out the 13th of December 1986 and it was 30p. And then once we've done with a quick review I'll come back to the beginning and then you probably have to use your pause button but you should be able to read the comic for yourself. So we're up to a new story, an American story, so it's written by Bob Budiansky and it's got Circuit Breaker in it and of course she has this vendetta with the Transformers and she's managed to collect, well not collect, um, capture the seven of the Autobots that appeared from the last story. It's pretty much just saying how that happened there and of course she's just after all robots. She doesn't know there's a difference between the good and the bad ones. Um, in the meantime, Bombshell has snuck into the Ark and he's planted something inside the brain of Optimus Prime. So, unfortunately for the Autobots, when he is transfer transferring the power of the Creation Matrix into the Aerial Bots, it's also going to go through to the Stunticons as well. All of this is, of course, unbeknownst to him. He hasn't got a clue. And what they've done is they've sent skids out to basically try and find the missing seven. And they're on the lookout for them. But in the meantime, the Decepticons have sent the Stunticons out to get skids. And this is pretty much where it's came up to. Quite a good story, to be honest. Right, we've got a comic competition here for Ready Breck, which is basically a kid's version. Well, it is porridge. A kid's breakfast cereal, which is porridge. And I hope the guide's there. Doesn't mind seeing that. Whoever he is, I wonder if he either reads the... Well, I wonder if he's still a Transformers fan. That would be really interesting. Right, this is brilliant because that's the same logo which we had in the UK. Uh, for film, whichever year it was, for film 1986, and it was a pro, and it was a film, obviously, review program with I think Barry Norman was still doing it at the same time. But here we go. I'm going to bring this over here so you can pause and read that, and then that. Oh, there we go. Then that. Then that. And then that. And okay, the funny thing of that is obviously it's Grimlock's take on reviewing the Transformers movie. We've still got Spitfires as the B story, just for the last few pages. And then we've got some classified ads, an advert for what's coming in next week. And there's a little Robo Capers story there as well. And wow, I don't know why, but I've just seen that and I've just, I totally, totally remember that from when I was a kid. Amazing. And then on the back, we've got the advert for the stars mail away play set that i'm still yet to see anyway that was the review hope you enjoyed it i'm going to go nice and slowly over all the text and you can read the comic for yourselves
there we go then guys that is the latest issue on this channel issue number 91 hope you enjoyed it and thanks for sticking with me thanks for watching like and comment and don't forget to subscribe